hi all. Recently the API ecosystem has grown significantly, in current digital transformation era, more and more organizations see API management as an important step in becoming digital. API Developers Portal enables the connection between producers and consumers of APIs by involving technology, business, and human aspects. Today we are going to discuss about the API management using Azure. Before looking into Azure, let's see the components comprising on of the Azure. Azure contains multiple components such as Publisher, Developer Portal, Gateway, etc. One of our customer came to us with a problem regarding publishing Boomi API into Azure and set up the API management, in order to perform extensive API management and monitor to help its app developers or customers for easy access and onboarding. As part of the solution our organization implemented APIs in Dell Boomi and performed the API management using the Azure. In this video we will demonstrate the API management using Azure. Before starting the demo let's see how an API implementation process which comprises of multiple stages such as design, secure, publish, etc. Now we are seeing the API management implementation steps. Now let's jump into the demo. For this demo, we are going to use an employee services API which is designed on Dell Boomi. Now let's validate the API in Dell Boomi platform. Here you can see the get employees resource is working fine. Here I am going to download the swagger spec file for publishing in Azure. Now let's create a proxy API using spec file. Here you can see the API proxy is created successfully. Now let's create an API product using the API proxy. Now let's browse the API in developers portal by clicking on developers portal and choose api here you can see the employee services api to access the api developer needs to sign up and subscribe to api now let's sign up as an app developer by providing the appropriate details and click on sign up now we need to verify the email id provided during the sign up process navigate to the mail and verify the mail here provide the credentials and login to the developers portal. Now let's subscribe to the product. Here click on the product and choose the desired product and click on subscribe and confirm. Here you can see that subscription request has been initiated. Once the subscription request is approved we will receive a mail notifying that subscription request is approved. Here you can see the subscription state is active. Now let's test the API navigate back to the employee services API and click on a resource to test the API. Here click on try it out and send button to execute the API. You can see that API is working. Now let's check the API in Postman using the subscription key. Here you can see the API is working as expected. That's all for this video. For any queries please reach us at vijay.trade at the rate of eaiesp.com.